Mitchum, Mr. Alfred Pascal, Death of Confectionery Manufacturer. The death occurred early on Wednesday morning at his house, Homeland, Croydon Road, Bennington, of Mr. Alfred Pascal, world famous confectionery manufacturer. He was 84. Born in Croydon in 1853, Mr. Pascal was the last of a direct Pascal family line that dated back to the 13th century. For many years, the family was associated with Mitcham. For 43 years, Mr. Alfred Pascal was connected with the business of James Pascal Limited, which was started by his brother in 1875. Up to his retirement 20 years ago, he was one of the foremost and most experienced members of the confectionery industry. Mr. Pascal proved that the so-called impossible could be done when in 1881 he made jam entirely through steam boiling, thus refuting the current ideas of the day on that subject. After a number of unsuccessful experiments, Mr. Pascal also made the popular sweet known the world over as Golden Malt X. In 1897, a big fire in London destroyed, among many other buildings, the Pascal Works in Blackfriars Place. Five years later, the present Mitchum factory, the home of sweets, was opened. Before the London Works were destroyed, Mr Pascal was successful in producing the first hollow chocolate Easter egg. When Mr Pascal retired, following the death of his brother, there were more than 3,000 employees under his supervision, and the immense growth of the Pascal organisation is clearly illustrated by the fact that 43 years previously, when Mr Alfred Pascal joined the organisation, the complete staff numbered only 12. He had deafness, caused by the constant noise of heavy machinery, but Mr Alfred Pascal never suffered any serious illness until May this year, when an X-ray examination revealed an internal growth. Afterwards, he slowly lost strength. He made many friends and was held in esteem by all who knew him. He came to Wallington 34 years ago, at which time he lived in Bramble Down Road, later moving to Stafford Road. In January this year, he moved to Croydon Road. The funeral took place today, Friday, at West Norwood Cemetery.